In the dramatic season four finale of The Real Housewives of Salt Lake City, Monica Garcia emerged as a pivotal figure, captivating viewers with her entanglement in the show's controversies. The revelation of her being one of the individuals behind the notorious Instagram gossip account, Reality Von Tees, marked a significant turning point in her narrative on the show. Initially, Monica had garnered a degree of empathy from the RHOSLC audience, who had been privy to the complexities and challenges in her relationship with her mother, Linda. This dynamic between mother and daughter had been a focal point throughout the season, offering an in-depth look at their strained interactions. However, the season's conclusion brought to light not just Monica's secret involvement in the Reality Von T's account, but also her tumultuous relationship with her mother, which had previously been glimpsed on the show. The issues escalated and spilled over into their lives outside the show, grabbing the attention of social media users. A leaked video, making rounds on social media platforms, captured a heated exchange between Monica and Linda, highlighting the depth of their conflict. The leaked footage, dated January 3, 2024, provided an unfiltered glimpse into Monica and Linda's volatile relationship. The argument, taking place in Monica's living room, centered around the fallout of Monica's trip with her fellow cast members to Bermuda. Linda was seen vehemently criticizing Monica, referring to the reality Von T's drama and its impact on the relationships within the group, particularly with cast members Heather Gay, Whitney Rose, Lisa Barlow, and Meredith Marks. Monica, in a defiant response, accused her mother of abandoning her and taking Angie Katzenevis's side during the infamous Greek Easter brunch incident in Season 4. The confrontation escalated with Linda chastising Monica for her on-camera behavior, leading to a dramatic climax where Monica, frustrated and emotionally charged, asked her mother to leave. The candid nature of this altercation, much more raw and unfiltered than what had been seen on RHOSLC, struck a chord with the audience. While Monica had been vilified for her role in the Reality Von T's scandal, this glimpse into her personal life elicited a wave of sympathy from some viewers, who were moved by the harsh reality of her off-camera interactions with her mother. In the aftermath of the video leak, Monica took to social media platform X, formerly known as Twitter, to address the situation. As the CEO of Brea Baby, Monica expressed a sense of resignation, acknowledging that the leak might be a form of karmic retribution for her actions related to the Reality Von T's account. She admitted to feeling that she deserved this exposure due to her past conduct, Monica identified her friend Tanesha Luckett as the person responsible for leaking the video, which was meant to remain private. She also implicated Tanesha as a co-conspirator in operating the Reality Von T's account. Monica's disclosure painted a picture of betrayal, detailing how she had trusted Tanesha with personal information and how this trust was broken with the public release of their private altercation. In her social media post, Monica lamented the comprehensive nature of Tanesha's betrayal, which included the release of various types of personal information and a concerted effort to undermine her publicly. This takedown strategy, as Monica described it, mirrored the tactics they had previously employed against other cast members and former RHOSLC star Jen Shaw. Monica concluded her statement with an apology to her mother, emphasizing that the leaked video was never intended for public viewing and clarifying that she was not the one who had leaked it. This incident, while shedding light on the personal struggles and complexities of reality TV personalities, also underscored the delicate balance between public personas and private lives in the realm of reality television.